Find your files with NeoFinder. NeoFinder is all about, and yeah, you have guessed it, finding, of course. There are so many ways to locate your precious files with NeoFinder. You almost lost count. Well, almost. Let's have a look. Number one, quick find. Just type the text you search here into the quick find field over there. And uh, after you finished, hit return. That was it. NeoFinder will immediately search all your catalogs and it will look for the text in every single text field it knows. And there are plenty of these. Sounds easy? It is. Very easy. But this is also really powerful because NeoFinder will parse your entire search text and search for separate words. So it doesn't matter if you type Kate Bush or Bush Kate. NeoFinder will find all songs of that musician for you in both cases. Both are the same results for you. So all there. NeoFinder can do that for you. Okay, number two, find in menu bar. If your NeoFinder is not running, or you simply quickly need to find something in another application, use the NeoFinder menu in the main menu of your Mac at any time. This will launch NeoFinder for you and immediately start the find. Super fast, super easy. And here are all the results, as you can see. Um, everything's there, there for you. Great. Okay, number three. If that's not enough, use the find editor. Here you have a lot more control over what it is found. Tell NeoFinder exactly what you need. You have loads of options. Everything that NeoFinder catalogs, all the pieces of metadata can be set up here for your search. Everything is here. See, names, ratings, music, special commands there, all the items that NeoFinder catalogs. It's all in here. You can set up any search you need, keywords, everything. And you can even save any complicated setup as a smart folder to use it again at any time later. So if you need more power, that's the find editor. Number four, find context through menu or find context menu. Select one file with the attributes you're interested in and let NeoFinder give you more items with these attributes in the context menu. There is the find menu. And you can see we have several options here depending on the file. We can search for the creation date, file check values, the name, and in this case, the geotag, the geographic position. And uh, we get a lot of hits from there. This is also really useful for songs, but also for photos and more. Number five, keywords, find keywords. That's really important. They are so important that we actually have added a little arrow there and a menu. And if you click in these, NeoFinder will search for all items with that keyword. There they are. And one click is all you need. That's, that's it. And this also actually works for the whole list of keywords, of course. Um, and they are also with the context menu. See if we can find something interesting. Uh, well, let's filter the list. Search for ah, HMS Queen Elizabeth. Okay. Let's see if we have any pictures with that keyword. Oh, yeah, we do. There she is. Nice. Brilliant. Okay. That's it. Number six, the find inspector. You can use the inspector to begin a search for similar items. Just use the context menu to click on any item you're interested in. Like here in this case, the artist, context menu, and the find option appears and all your results are here. So here we have all items that we can find from this particular artist in the NeoFinder database. Number seven, to help you find duplicate files, NeoFinder can run a very special kind of search for you. Depending on what you set up here in this window, you can quickly locate any duplicate items in your catalogs. Say, with the same name, file check, or just photos, all files, whatever you need, maybe with a particular size. And you can even do the reverse and search for unique files. These are the files that you need to back up quickly, very quickly. Let NeoFinder search them for you. <laughs> okay, number eight, find similar photos. That is an extraordinary feature in NeoFinder and it's the ability to search photos that look similar. Select the photo you like and ask NeoFinder to get you all the photos with a similar motive. 
Okay, so we have selected the picture we are interested in. And then we can set up how similar we want the results to be and then hit search. And that's it. And uh, as NeoFinder needs to analyze all thumbnails, this will take a moment for a large library. But you get all the results, um, including black and white versions of the picture, uh, picture of different resolutions, definitely pictures with a different name but the same motive, and of course, just similar pictures that were taken maybe at the same spot with a slightly different setup. It's all there for you. And that's not even all. Number nine. NeoFinder is integrated into Apple's Finder. Select any file you see, in this case that picture, and use the services contextual menu to ask NeoFinder to find other files with that same name. Or select any text in a text editor and search for that text. That also works. This is very powerful. There are the results. And there is more. <laughs> That's not enough. You can use Apple Script, for example, um, or very special find URLs to start a search from different applications. Uh, the NeoFinder User's Guide has all the details for you, and you can find it in the Help menu of NeoFinder. It's really helpful. Go there, check it out. That's a lot. So we are sure you will find your perfect way to find. <laughs> NeoFinder, one tool to find them all. Enjoy!